let m be real vector space of 2 by 3 matrices with real entries let t is a linear transformation defined from m to m by this uh, formula or expression then determinant of t is actually this is asked about the matrix representation of t and its determinant how to find matrix representation of a linear transformation first what is v m is a vector space and containing all 2 by 3 matrices so a11 a11 a12 a13 a21 a22 and a23 this types of matrix comes in vector space m and its size of the matrix is 2 by 3 and these a11 or a i j are coming from real field means this is a vector space over r and t is defined from m to m means same vector space and same field if field are different then we can this uh, transformation will not satisfy the property of c c u plus v and operate with t not equal to c of t u plus t v this property will not hold and we can't say about this is a linear transformation so it is necessary condition to make a linear transformation field should be same here field should be same and uh, field is real field for this particular question if this type of matrix or any size of matrix what is a standard ordered basis so you can write this matrix a11 a12 a13 a21 a22 a23 if this matrix then you can write a11 write one here and other entry make zero plus a12 one here and make other entry zero plus a13 and write other entry zero similarly a21 and other entry make zero plus and so on so these matrices these matrices this matrices this matrix this matrix this matrix this and two more matrix matrices will form ordered basis so ordered basis is or elements of order basis are this one this one this these are elements of ordered basis and we have find we have find image of ordered basis element image of ordered basis element you can see here so write you can write each matrix you can write each matrix in linear combination of ordered basis element ordered basis elements so this image can be written as linear combination in ordered basis or if ordered basis can be represented by e1 e2 e3 e4 e5 e6 so this matrix 0 0 1 0 0 0 can be written as linear combination of e3 because of this entry is e3 e3 0 times e1 plus 0 times e2 plus 1 times e3 plus 0 times e4 plus 0 times e5 plus 0 times e6 so this en entry or you can write image of 
this matrix will be third position is 1 0 0 1 0 0 0 this will be 6 by 6 matrix write coefficient either row wise or column wise it's your choice second entry at six position will be one so write one here and make other entry zero and for third fourth entry is zero one fourth entry is one and other entries are zeros for this fifth entry is one and other entries are zero and for this matrix first entry is minus one and other entries are zero now we have to find determinant of a determinant of t we need to find determinant of t it means matrix representation of t find its determinant and how to find determinant of a matrix either you can expand directly or if anyhow you can reduce matrix in reduce echelon form or row reduced echelon form and then it's uh, you can easily find its eigenvalue so product of eigenvalues is considered as is considered as determinant if anyhow you can find the eigenvalue of this matrix then determinant will be product of eigenvalue product of eigenvalue and to find determinant of this it is very easy first first arrange this matrix first non zero entity so this is minus 1 0 0 0 and uh, choose this is r6 choose a choose a row containing 1 1 2 3 4 5 i think i left one entry here 1 2 3 4 5 6 which one i left i left this entry so write 1 2 3 4 so fourth row will be 0 1 0 0 0 0 this is fourth row r4 so write r4 here you are applying eros elementary row operations and the elementary row operation doesn't alter the determinant of a matrix so he, there is no loss for determinant so you can apply conveniently elementary row operation 0 1 0 0 0 this is r4 now choose this row r1 0 0 1 0 0 0 this is r1 now r3 0 0 0 1 0 0 this is r3 now r5 here 1 and other entries are 0 and r6 means r2 0 0 0 0 0 0 this is my equivalent matrix of this matrix and its eigenvalues are minus 1 1 1 1 1 and 1 and its product will be its product product i use this sign product is minus 1 so determinant of t is minus 1 determinant of this is minus 1 